Hey there, everyone. I am that 80s nostalgic toy guy. I want to thank you all for joining me at the collector's table. This is my first video since we've reached 300 subscribers. This has just been the beginning, and you guys have helped me grow so quickly, and I'm so excited, so happy that you guys have subscribed and stuck around with me and have shown me that you enjoy these collectibles, these pop culture icons, these action figures, these toys, every bit as much as me. I thank you guys very much. Thank you for being a friend. I'm so excited that in celebration of 300 subscribers, I wanted to do a dance. Let's dance! So we're going to do a little dance pop culture style. We're going to dance with the cast of Pulp Fiction. Want to dance? It was a teenage wedding and the old folks wished them well. Pulp Fiction is one of my favorite 90s films. It is a cult classic. It is a crazy movie. <laughs> it is an action movie. It is a thriller movie. It's a comedy movie. What do they call it? They call it uh, Royale with cheese. Royale with cheese. That's right. It is, for a lack of better terms, a bad butt movie. I try to keep it PG here. Let's just keep it PG. Just know that. <laughs> 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 but you know what I'm saying. This movie kicked butt. I like to kick people's butts. So when NECA came out with this Geoms set, for Pulp Fiction, I was hooked. There are four individual sets of four characters representing all the shenanigans of Pulp Fiction. I'll pistol whip the next guy that says shenanigans. You mean shenanigans? No. Oh. You're talking about shenanigans, right? Put those away. Pulp Fiction came out in 1994, and we've been loving it ever since. And in the age of memes, Pulp Fiction has got unlimited memes. and they are funny, and we know why they're funny, because you and I lived through this, we watched this movie in theaters, we rented it on VHS, we can't get enough of Pulp Fiction. <music> to start out by unboxing of the NECA Geoms Pulp Fiction line, I'm gonna go ahead and start out with a bang with the four main characters, the four figure set NECA is calling The Cast. On this box art, you'll see the cartoon figure of Mia and just this awesome retro nostalgic look here of that front box art. Top box art, you'll see Pulp Fiction and NECA Geoms. You'll see that it says the cast and it has the list of the cast here. On the side, you have more Pulp Fiction, the cast, the list of the cast, and NECA Geoms. On that side, you have more of the same. You are no different. On the back side of this box art, we're going to see all the sets that the NECA Geoms Pulp Fiction line contains. But we're gonna briefly look at that. I'm gonna show it to you because I don't wanna give away too much. But there it is, all four of those sets. I have all four sets. We're starting out with the cast set and we're gonna move on down the line. He's on down, he's on down the road. As always, the bottom of the package has nothing we care about. As you can see, this open face box here shows us everything we're gonna get. There are actually extra pieces in here. We have hands in here that have weapons. That is awesome. We're gonna get all this stuff out. We have Vincent, played by John Travolta. Hello. We have Jules, played by Samuel L. Jackson. You know who we are? We have Mia, played by Uma Thurman. Yummy. And we have Marcellus, played by the awesome Ving Rhames. There is no me in you. If you are a fan of any of these four actors, a fan of Pulp Fiction, a fan of 90s movies, a fan of crazy movies, go ahead and leave me a comment. Let's talk because I'm a fan as well of all four of these actors, the movie Pulp Fiction and 90s film. I love all of it. So let me hear from you. Give me a call. I'll fly with you. Also, if you haven't liked this video yet, you're still with me. Go ahead and hit that like button. If you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and help me grow my numbers. And then you're hitting subscribe. Go ahead and hit that notification bell. 
That way you don't miss out on the future of Pulp Fiction unboxings because I have more than just this. I love pop culture and what I do here is delve into the nostalgia of pop culture and Pulp Fiction is definitely 90s pop culture. That's so 90s. And I've got a lot of Pulp Fiction action figures and collectibles and memorabilia to go over on this channel. So go ahead and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on that and all the awesome, fun, entertaining unboxings that I do going forward. Thank you all very much. Back to Pulp Fiction NECA Geomes four figure set called The Cast. Let's get these guys out of the box. Simple cardboard piece here, we flip that up and we can remove them. Inside here we got a nice little cardboard diorama here that you can set your figures up in if you want to. Stop thinking about what I want, what he wants, what your parents want. What do you want? We pop the characters out. One, two, three, and four. And there we go. All four of the Pulp Fiction main cast, all four of the NECA Geomes right there on the collector's table. Look at those cute little killing machines. Killing in the name of These characters are awesome. When I saw this four figure set, I had to have it. And then I saw that there were three other four figure sets. I had to have them. All the main characters, plus doubles of these characters and all their glory of our favorite scenes from 1994's Pulp Fiction. I cannot wait to unbox those, but back to the cast. We have the four main figures here. Of course, we have Vincent, we have Jules, we have Mia, and we have Marcellus. We're putting the band back together. If you're a fan of Pulp Fiction like me, you know these characters very well. You know the craziness of Pulp Fiction, the inappropriate hilarity that happens within Pulp Fiction. Just an amazing movie. So we have Vincent here in that nice black suit and that black tie and white undershirt that he wears throughout most of the film. Really nice paint job on these characters here. There are more than 14 points of articulation on these little guys. That's right, more than 14 points of articulation. And on three of the four characters, Vincent, Jules, and Marcellus, we have a removable hand with a gun in the hand. That is pretty cool for these small little figures. It's pretty cool, I guess. These figures are right around three inches tall, so that is a lot of articulation for a three inch figure. Each face has that nice little cartoonish uh, paint job there on the face, and Vincent has that slick back hair. Well, you know the show's on TV? I don't watch TV. So the points of articulation for each of these characters is at the head, the shoulders, the elbows, right there at the wrists, also the hips, the knees, and right here at the feet, these big old feet. The feet are kind of flattish, like Bozo the Clown. But that's a really cool Vincent right there. Vincent also comes with another hand with a pistol in it. It looks like this hand with the pistol can be placed in either hand. Let's do the right hand. Pop that out, put the pistol hand in, and there you go. You have Vincent with a pistol in his hand. Well, you gotta have an opinion. Not only is that hand removable, the pistol is removable too. Look at that little guy. Stay tuned for the close-up videos just momentarily. You'll see these little guns up close and personal. My specialty is way too close-up magic. Pick a card. I, I can't see. They are actually pretty cool for these little pieces. NECA did a really, really fascinating job with these little guys. So happy to add these to my collection. I want Vincent with his gun in his hand. I think I want all these characters with their guns in their hands. You can cock Vincent's head to the side like he's looking down the barrel of the gun. Set him down there. Then we take a look at Mia. Mia has that nice black slick back hair. She's got like a scowl on her face right there. I like that. She has the 14 points of articulation. She's wearing that outfit that she wears through a lot of the film. She does smoke in the film. So in her hand comes this little cigarette that has a red tip like it's lit. Don't let them break up your mind. So that's pretty neat. So the white top, the black pants, and the gray shoes, and that little cigarette uh, accessory there. Really cool piece. She moves at the waist too. But yeah, more than 14 points of articulation. These things are cool. You cool, man. Set her down right there. Then we have Jules. He has his 14 points of articulation. He has that nice black poofy hair, just like he does in the film. <laughs> and that nice facial hair. 
which you'll see here momentarily in the close-up shots. He's wearing that black suit, black tie, just like he wears throughout most of the film. He also comes with an extra hand and gun accessory. We're gonna remove this right hand, put this hand holding the gun right back in here, just like that, and there you go. You have Jules with this gun, 14 points of articulation, poofy hair, and black suit, just like in the film. Really cool little piece. Like, totally cool. We're gonna set him down there, which brings us to last but not least, Marcellus. You ain't got no problem, Jules. The boss, the man. He comes as that bald head crazy man right there. You remember that band-aid on the back of his head? We don't want to think. We want to know. He comes with those earrings as well, as you can see there, and that gray suit that he wears, and the pink undershirt. Tell me, I've to do. And pinkish shoes. Also, 14 plus points of articulation. His face paint is more of an angry face paint. He's been ticked off and he's ready to beat the crap out of someone. <laughs> <laughs> he also comes with an extra hand and gun accessory. We're going to remove this right hand. Replace this right hand with the hand that has a gun in it. Nice silver gun there. Really cool. All three of these weapons are, are sort of different too, so that's nice. Which is nice. We're going to set him down right there. And there we go. There's NECA Geom's four-figure set. The cast, we have Vincent, we have Mia, we have Jules, we have Marcellus. Really cool little set. This is one of four sets that I'm going to be unboxing for the channel. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss those other three unboxings. And while you're doing that, go ahead and hit that like button on this video because you're still here with me. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I am that A's nostalgic toy guy. This has been NECA Geom's four-figure set, The Cast, from 1994's Pulp Fiction. The cult classic 1990s film, one of my favorite 90s films for so many reasons. So if you like Pulp Fiction, you like any of these actors or actress, if you like 90s films, if you like crazy, wacky, action-filled comedies like I do, leave me some comments. Let's talk. All you have to do today is pick up that phone and speak the words. Thank you for joining me at the collector's table. I can't wait to get back here to unbox something awesome, something cool, something old, or something new. I'll see you again real soon. If you like this video, if you like the one before and the one before, and you haven't subscribed yet, please hit that subscribe button. I appreciate it very much. Uh, if you look forward to more fun and entertaining videos like the one you just watched, go ahead and click that subscribe button. I am that A's Nostalgia Toy Guy, and I look forward to seeing you again real soon.